So NHL 15 is supposed to have better puck physics. Now, I don't know why, because NHL 14 had pretty good puck physics. I mean, like it was pretty good. That, that could happen. Like sometimes the puck does just land on the goalie's back. And anyway, that could happen. That happens in real life, I'm sure. I bet you, it, I'm pretty sure it has anyway. Anyway, it probably doesn't happen very often in the game. But uh, yeah, I don't really think there was a big need for the puck physics. Probably not that big of a deal. All right, so that one landed on his shoulder, but like, not that bad. Not that big of a deal. And one, all right, that one's on his helmet. Okay, so maybe a couple little tweaks, but nothing major. Like, it never really costs a goal or anything. Okay. So, let's just see that again real quick. All right, so maybe, maybe we can work on the puck physics just a little bit. Like maybe just make it so that goals count when the puck's in the net. Maybe just that. 